Hello and welcome to Comment Comeback, the show where I go back to one of my older videos and choose a bunch of interesting comments to uh, talk about. This time I chose the good old Justin Bieber video, which about 98% of people did actually agree with, but the 2% that didn't, I mean, they're pretty amazing. So, I mean, let's just get into it then. It's about the comments, not about the intro. You all are messed up. You all are haters. Now, I, I don't like calling out people who spell things wrong, because, you know, there's so many different factors. They might not speak English, uh, na um... You wouldn't say naturally, would you? Natively. But, I mean... Messed. M-E-S-T. I mean, I, I've, I've made a video myself about how weird the English language is, but um, I, I just can't take you seriously when you spell it like that. It's so silly. You, know, you can even see that I even up, I like upvoted the comment. I liked it because I thought, hey, there's no way this can be serious. This is obviously someone just sort of pretending. And then I was like, went on their channel and saw, oh, I guess, I guess this is a real human who thought that. Man, that, that explains a lot. I don't understand why people hate Justin Bieber. Like, it doesn't make any sense. You know, have you seen Justin Bieber in interviews and stuff? He 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 can't help but say like after everything. He's like, uh, "Hey, my name is Justin Bieber. Like, um, I was at this gig this one time, and like, I was doing a dance like, and it was whoa. I mean, crazy. Like, I mean, that was that was a terrible, terrible impression, but uh, you get the idea. I mean, we all have that that thing that we say a lot. I, what what the hell am I even talking about here? This person with a duck picture is the. Avatar. Okay, so you don't understand why people why people hate Justin Bieber. Like it doesn't make any sense. It does make sense. I actually made about a five minute long video completely, you know, explaining why I felt the way I do. It's not particularly complicated. I thought I laid it out pretty clearly actually. I thought it's because he's a child star who abuses his money and fame in a way to uh, sort of be a nuisance. But at the same time I said I kind of feel sorry for him because he was a child star and it seems difficult to handle that sort of fame when you were so young. Justin was defending himself. Oh, oh god. I didn't realise that. I might have to take the video down now. I feel pretty bad that he was defend- no. No. Okay, th there's- I did- I, I mentioned this in the video. I mentioned in the video that it must be pretty horrific to be just chased down by popper- popperazzi- paparazzi just- continuously and relentlessly, but at the same time, you don't have to threaten them to attack them like, What do you say to me? I'm, what do you say to me? I'm gonna beat you up! That was my second Justin Bieber impression. I think that was a lot more accurate. It's like, come on, just, just, just dial, dial it back a bit. Just, if you're gonna just abuse, you know, drugs and alcohol and all, all that nonsense and then just go on stage and puke everywhere and then be like, Oh, I'm sorry, I'm sorry guys, I didn't, I'm just having a hard time right now being super rich and stuff. It's really hard for me, you know? No, he, he needs to just go away. Is That's the only thing I can think that he should do. Just just leave. Damn, man, you don't know anything about him. I mean, you put all the bad clips of him. You were just like the others brainwashed. <clears throat> brainwashed, huh? Why don't you put any nice clips of him? Oh, yeah, because this is the kind of channel that contains hate content. If this may be your answer, you can maybe stop... No, you maybe can stop making this kind of clips. Better make something that you can really... S no, can... You really can say you hate, not a boy who is better than you at all, peace. What? What? Okay, th there is... There is, um... I did show lots of bad clips of him because there are so many bad clips of him. There's being fair and I guess I kind of was pretty negative about him, but... I don't give a shit about Justin Bieber, so why would I... Why the hell would I say, man, I really... You know, Justin Bieber, he's done some stuff, but he's learnt from it, you know? I was talking to him the other week, and I was like, Hey, Justin, you know, you know that time where you, you use the M-word in a joke, like, really inappropriately? Yeah? Well, you didn't mean that, did you? You were just joking around. Oh, yeah, yeah, I was totally joking around. I didn't mean that at all. Okay, I, I forgive you, you know? I, you're a great person. Do you, do you give to... You don't happen to give to charity as well, do you? Oh, yeah, I, I give to charity. I even went to this orphanage the other week as well, and they were all like, Oh, sweet, Justin Bieber's visited us, sweet. Did you give them any money of your own and sort of, you know, help them with their lives, maybe? Made their lives better? Well, I, well, I didn't do that, that's asking too much of me. I've only got, like, 400 billion sat in the bank, you know, that would that would sort of dent it a little bit, you know? But that went, that went on for far too long. It's funny how they 
all of these people, every single one of them, their argument can be flipped around in the exact same way to make a point against them. You are just like the others brainwashed. What? You've been brainwashed to like Justin Bieber. I mean, it's kind of cliche at this point to hate Justin Bieber and um, call him out on his shit. But I think I think people are actually starting to move past it. It's like, Justin Bieber does this thing. Oh, so he's done that, has he? I guess. Huh. Well, I didn't see that co- I don't know about you, Dave. Did you see that coming? No, I, re- I didn't see that coming. I didn't realize Justin Bieber was a spoiled asshole with no real sort of code of, of ethics. He's just sort of a monster, really. I apologize for this episode. I, I'm high on Lemsip. For once, he has a video that has more likes and dislikes. I'm just gonna get off this bloody channel now. Now, I, I don't know about you, but I went through and looked at the stats at every single one of my videos. I don't know why I said I don't know about you, but... I went through the stats of all my old videos, and none of them has more dislikes than likes. So, I don't know what they were talking about. And they said, they said, I'm just gonna get off this bloody channel now. I mean, if you don't like it, why did why did you stay for so long? Why, Luna Space Tiger? I love your art, by the way. Really, it's really good. Oh, it's... <sighs> Fucking Christ. I don't care what he did in the past. Pass? I don't care what he did in the past. I will always be a believer. Good, I guess. If, you, if you're gonna... At least you're dedicated, I'll give you that. And it's... <laughs> again, you can just say... Oh, I didn't care what he did in the past. I will always be a blank. Technically, anything he's done is in the past. Anything he does, anything he's called out on will be in the past. So basically, you're saying, oh, he can do whatever I want, or he wants. And I'll still be like, sweet, I'm going to buy your, your album with your great songs on it. I'm going to jam to that tonight. I fucking, I hate, I hate YouTube comments. Just can't fucking do it. I just can't fucking do it. Shell of a real human. This video is not funny at all, and it is seriously sad. You need to stop. Stop hating on Justin Bieber just because you are jealous of how amazing and beautiful he is. You need to go to a psychiatrist and get help, please, because you are seriously hurting the IQ of the population with your hate for someone who is making this world a better place. All you do is complain. Justin Bieber represents dreams coming true. You need to see a psychiatrist and get help because you're hurting the IQ of the population? What? They just sort of made this, this, these statements of things that I don't know how they're related at all to the video that I made. And the reasoning for why I should stop making videos is because I'm jealous of how amazing and beautiful he is. But I, I don't understand your argument. He is a teenager who makes mistakes and learns from them. At least he made it big where you only have 4,917 subscribers smiley face. How the fuck does he learn from his mistakes? Can, can somebody inform me, please? Has, has he ever come out and said, Look, guys, you know, I'm Justin Bieber. I know, I know what I've done. You know what? You know what? I've been crazy in the past. I have been absolutely crazy. And I'm, I'm going to turn around from here. I, 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 I admit I've made mistakes. I admit I shouldn't have done that thing that you all hate me for. I'm just going to I'm just gonna take a break. I'm going to go and buy a small island and live on that for a bit and just fuck all of you. No. If he, if he did make an apology, it would be him. Standing in a room looking at his shoes or holding a bit of paper all scrunched over just like Hi, my name is Justin Bieber and I want to formally apologize for blankety blank 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 I am super sorry and stuff. Please forgive me and make sure you buy my new t-shirt because Because I love you all and you're all my fans Peace out people uh, I'm sorry so this perfectly reasonable youtuber um Mazer Rackham called this guy out on his weird comment. Since when did he learn from them? Meaning, since when did he learn from his mistakes? To which this person replied with, Since now? Obviously you haven't seen the stuff he's been doing lately, like going to Japanese orphanages and meeting all these kids in need. Plus he is just keeping to himself. Just because he hasn't done anything major recently doesn't mean he hasn't learned from his mistakes. It also doesn't mean that he has learned from his mistakes. It means that some guy like his producer or whatever the fuck they call it, went, Hey Justin, uh, I was looking at the news and everyone sort of thinks you're a huge cock. Oh, what shall I do about that, producer? Well, what you need to do is you need to go to Japan and go to the orphanages there and meet all the kids in need. Yeah, but how's that going to help anyone? Well, it's going to make you look good. That's what it's going to do. Okay? Okay, I'll go to Japan then and make, make my image better. 
I'm not going to actually help these kids in need. I'm just going to sort of greet them. I'm going to go say hello to them and then leave. I mean, it's, they might get a good memory out of it, but more likely they're going to resent you for being super rich and pretty much rubbing it in their faces by just turning up and looking at them. I mean, really, what, what's he going to do with these orphanages? Just go up to them and be like, oh, hi, hi, orphan. How? I'm really rich. How was your day? Oh, I've got no parents and I'm just really upset all the time. Great. I, did you know I just released a new album? Do you want a t-shirt? Fuck off. Critics are funny little people. Now, I, I assume, I assume that's talking about me? I, I, I'd like to thank this person for calling me a critic because that validates my opinion, as it were. Instead of calling me a hater or whatever, which implies that there is no rationale behind it. Nothing rational about it at all. But when you say critic, that kind of implies, huh, maybe that person is voicing opinion, an, an opinion. That I don't have to agree with, but calling them funny little people, I guess, undermines all of that. I've noticed people on the internet have to do this thing where when they're insulted or are doing the ins insult, they have to they have to say that the person they are arguing with or whatever is little or small or a kid because that's the only way you, you can imply dominance over them is by physically reducing their size in your brain to sort of think that, well, you are less intimidating to me and have no point because you are either younger or smaller physically than me. So that's just a thing I've noticed quite a lot of people do, and it's, uh, it's, hey, you wanna, you want me to just completely ignore your your comment or opinion? Call me a, a little whatever or a small whatever or a kid. This is like so fucking stupid. You doesn't even know him, you little child. Oh, oh, what did I just say about the child small thing? Stop it. It's not your business what he does with his life. Imagine you are on his position. OMG twat. So it's not my business. Okay, that's true. It isn't my business, but it doesn't really matter because it's posted everywhere and there's no way of really avoiding it. What he does with his life is his life. Imagine if I was in his position. Well, if I, right now, was to were to swap with Justin Bieber and I just had full control of him, but I still have my mentality, I'd be, I just, I would do what I keep saying. I'd just be like, okay, I'm just going off the radar. Fuck it, I'm just going to go and enjoy being a super rich young kid. I'll just go explore the world, do whatever. Don't need to do anything creative anymore because I've I've won, I've succeeded. But I guess what you mean is, what would you do in his situation if you were like 10 years old or whatever you were, he was, and suddenly got a load of fame? Um, in which case, it's hard to tell because it completely depends on a on a wide variety of variables like your upbringing, the, your parents, your, your just natural sense of morality and all that sort of nonsense. Basically, this is the stupidest thing I've ever read in my entire life. It is pathetic that all all of you spend so much time hating a boy you don't even know. Yeah, you're right. It's almost as pathetic as spending all your time defending someone you don't even know. According to your username, you hate everything. So, who cares what you hate? I don't know, let me just... Oh, looks like about... Hmm. Over 10,000 people. Last time I checked, 10,000 was quite a big number, especially when related to people. Fuck you. Fuck you. These are just my favorite comments. I mean, they just add so much to the YouTube system. They're, they're keeping, they're keeping the ball rolling. They're keeping the, the comments lively. They're keeping everything just ah, so good, and I just love it so much. Um, I, I don't want to. Please stop. Please just fucking stop. These videos do something to me I have never experienced before in my life. They're so draining. They're so emotionally destructive to my to my psyche. I just can't do it. That these people, these people making the just this, the weirdest, the strangest, the most fan fanboyish comments. I just I just can't I just can't do it. Every single time I, I sit here just recording audio straight for half an hour, just reading comment after comment. You're just jealous. You're an idiot. Fuck you. You're the worst human alive for having an opinion. What do you mean you don't like the thing that I like? You're awful. Please. I beg of you. Just, if you're one of these people, if you've ever done one of these things, you gotta stop. You've gotta do something about it. Did you know hot dogs get a bad rap? They're actually pretty good. They get... 
you got the, the mustard and you got the the bun. It's just they get a bad rap, you know. I can talk to plants. Plants. I can whisper to them. They're not ha very happy at the moment. I watched that happen and Christ, it was terrible. Oh my lord, oh my lord, these bloody videos. So that's it, guys. Um, or girls, or whatever alien, green alien creature who's watching this video. What did you think? Did you, do you agree with me? Or do you hate me and think I'm the worst thing in the world ev ever? Tell me in the comments below. Make sure to check out some of my other videos that aren't quite as rambling and, and weird. And about Justin Bieber. You know, I've got, I got way better videos. Go and watch them as well. If you if you got this far. What's, I mean, all I can do is apologize for how, how weird this video was. Because uh, I have a cold at the moment. It may not sound like it. Because I just, I just took so many different drugs to sort of make my voice not sound awful. Because it really did earlier. It was all sort of croaky and like... Oh, I got a cold. Oh no, look at me. Yeah, look, even this end bit is going on way longer than I usually do. Now, let's just let's just put in the ending bit here so it just stops. It just stops. Thanks for watching. All comments and ratings are appreciated. Thanks for watching. I think I feel like I've missed something off the end. Bye. Where's the, where the fuck is the limb sip? <laughs> Too many cups of lem sip for me. Too many cups of lem sip. <coughs> Jesus. <coughs> Cold lem sip. Oh my god. Cold lem sip. Going down the wrong way. It's not enjoyable. <coughs>